What's up everyone, John Rettinger from Techno Buffalo here with an unboxing for you of the Rover Puck by Clearwater. It's a mobile hotspot that can be shared up to eight different devices at once. Let's go ahead and get started. Alright, so let me give you a bit of background on what this is. Uh, this Rover Puck is the pay-as-you-go option of Clearwire. The folks that built and maintained the WiMAX network used here in the US, which actually Sprint uses for their 4G services. So as I mentioned, this is pay-as-you-go and the pricing scheme on this is really very impressive. Uh, so if you want to have unlimited access for a day, it's going to cost you just 5 bucks. If you want unlimited access for a week, it's going to cost you $20 and unlimited access for a month is going to give you $50. When I say unlimited, uh, there's no gigabyte or bandwidth really restrictions here. You can use uh, as much as you can. Uh, Speed-wise, this is a 4G network. You're going to get about 3 to 6 megabits per second down and about 1 megabit per second up. You can activate all this stuff online and you can re-up your account online as they're telling you right there. Uh, one thing to know though, this does not have a 3G fallback, so it won't fall back to... Uh, EVDO or HSDPA or anything like that. It's strictly a 4G device. You're going to want to check with the folks at Rover uh, and Clearwire to make sure that you have 4G in your area. Uh, it's going to set you back just about $149 for this device. But if you're the kind of person who travels occasionally and you want to be able to have internet wherever you go, but you don't want to be stuck paying a monthly fee or be stuck in a contract, uh, this is really going to be a decent option for you. All right, so let's go ahead and dig in. The battery supposedly is going to last up to four hours uh, and can be charged while plugged in. So I'll pull it off, and there is the Rover Puck, which is not used uh, for hockey. Go ahead and pull this part back. I have not seen one of these yet in person, so I'm very curious uh, how big or how small it's going to be. Push that off to the side. Looks like there's nothing else inside. So here's a Rover Puck. We finally got a WiMAX 4G service here in Southern California. I've been very excited to uh, to try this. So quick start guide. There's a quick start guide. Probably tells you how to register your stuff online. There is a sticker. You're also going to get, it's like a car charger, which is a standard USB port. You've got your wall charger outlet and it charges via Micro USB. So sort of your standard stuff you'd get in a cell phone box. Uh, here is the Rover Puck. Go ahead and pull it off. Uh, it's, it's, not, it's not the smallest thing in the world. It's about the size of, let's say, a coaster. Uh, we you put your drink on. Certainly you don't want to put your drink on it, but it gives you some sort of sense of comparison uh, for size. Uh, here is the Nexus S, for example. I always sort of do cell phone comparisons so you guys can sort of get a sense as to how big uh, or small uh, you might think this is. So I'm going to go ahead and use it, review it, and we'll do a test on network speed and see how everything works. I'm going to go ahead and charge it up and uh, let's go ahead and see if 4G service pay as you go is uh, just what the doctor ordered. There'll be a link down below in case you want to check out Rover service and see if they're supported where you are and also some purchasing information. Anyway guys, I'm John Rettinger from Techno Buffalo. See you in the next video. Bye-bye.